Okay guys, before I begin explaining the technique, I would like to tell you a bit more about the origins of Venice Walls. Venice Walls is a ballroom dance originated in the 18th century in Vienna, Austria. It is twice as fast than the slow walls, it's a rotary dance and typically performed in a closed hold. Prepare to dance around the ballroom, direction anti-clockwise. There's two turns that take you round the ballroom, natural turn, turning right, and reverse turn, turning left. Let's have a closer look at natural turns first. We will break it down in couples and individually. First, establish a strong connection with lady's right side and man's right side, not allowing any shifting during the dance, as that can cause difficulty to get round each other. Remember that step one is a strong travelling step, whether it's taken back or forward, there is no turn yet on this step. Allow your partner to move around you on steps 2 and 3 if you're moving back. And if you're moving forward, make sure you're traveling all the way around your partner on steps 2 and 3. Whether you're moving back or forward, step 1 should be taken down the line of dance. Now let's break down ladies steps. Ladies, extend back and away from your partner, keeping your right hip always forward and towards your partner while you dance. On step one, release left leg quickly at the end of previous step to get out of man's way to create space for him to move into. On step two, allow your partner to pass by taking a small step to the side and staying left. On step 3, close your feet together by drawing your left foot in, stay grounded and allow your body to complete the turn. Step 4 is a big step, driving along the line of dance, stay left and away from man's space and prepare to take a bigger step around him next. Step 5, swing left leg forward and swivel the foot at the end of the step. On step 6, close your feet together, releasing the left foot quickly for the beginning of next turn. And now practice this over and over again, paying attention to the direction of line of dance for your step 1. Also, be aware of the center of the room so that you can take a side step diagonally to center. To change from natural turn to reverse turn, Use a step side close change. And now let's break down the men steps or the leader steps for natural turn. Here also you need to be aware of your right side that is connected to your partner at all times. Use strong range of motion for step one, guiding lady to inside of turn. Here you have strong contra body movement, which sets your left side to continue leading on step 2 and 3. On step 2, take a big step around the partner. Step 3, close your feet together, preparing your left foot to step back and away from your partner. Step 4, big step down the line of dance. Step 5 is a small step to the side, monitoring that your lady is successfully taking a step around you. Step 6, drag your left foot in to close and maintain this way until the next step. And now practice this over and over again, paying attention to the direction of line of dance for your step 1. Also, be aware of the center of the room so that you can take a side step diagonally to center. Reverse turn is normally used to travel down long side. The progression is straight down the line of dance. Unlike in natural turn, here there is almost no body movement and practically no sway. Keep solid contact with the feet to the floor. It helps to provide control, balance and make steps smoother. 
first establish a strong connection with ladies' right side and men's right side, not allowing any shifting during the dance, as that can cause difficulty to get round each other. Allow your partner to move around you on steps 2 and 3 if you're moving back. And if you're moving forward, make sure you're traveling all the way around your partner on steps 2 and 3. Remember that step 1 is a strong traveling step. Whether it's taken back or forward, there is no turn yet on this step. To avoid dizziness, instead of spotting on one spot, spot different spots on the wall. On step 1, step with the right foot back and slightly to side, toe slightly turned in. Step 2 is a small step to the side, keeping track of men's movement around you. On step 3, drag right foot to close in keeping nice and flat. Take step 4 straight towards your partner and down the line of progression. On step 5, take right foot forward and then turn on the ball of the foot. On step 6, continue turning on right foot, then left foot crosses in front. And now practice this over and over again, keeping the movement as flat as you can, and ladies, keep your right arm slightly in front of you, pressing it towards your partner. This will help you maintain a very good line throughout this movement. Now guys, on step 1, step forward and towards your partner, keeping track of her movement around you. On step 2, take a big step forward and then turn at the end on the ball of the foot, which will cause left foot to cross in front of right foot on step 3. Keep your feet nice and tight and parallel. It is very important to keep left side leading forward on step 1 and right side leading back when you're moving back on step 4. And now practice this over and over again, keeping the movement as flat as you can and keeping your knees flexed. And now let's have a quick look at natural turn and reverse turn to music again. Mm -hmm. 